Guess who's back? Uh, back again. Mm -hmm. And Betsy, and Case, all of us. We're all here, the whole family's here. Yeah, the whole okay. family's here. So you brought us some great tomato toast earlier, and now we're hopping into maybe what you can sip on the patio. For the yeah, of so yeah. look, the whole thing about this, this year, this 4th of July, is I want it to be easy for everybody. Like, you guys need to be able to spend time with your family, spend time with your friends. I don't like to spend time with my family. Sure, you guys sure. all know that. That's kind of what I'm You gotta make I, family I tolerable them, But I do have people coming over. I'm kidding, mom, my sister. <laughs> Everyone's um, watching, I'm sure. But, so what you want is to be able to kind of create something that you can then just kind of forget about it and then mm -hmm. everybody can kind of sip on. Sangria is that thing. And we're gonna do this and we're gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna sip it. Honestly, what you want from sangria is for it to sit for a couple of hours, okay. right? So it kind of gains some, complex, some complexity and some flavor. But for time's sake, it's perfectly fine to, 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 to make it and then drink it. So I'm using nectarines today, guys, probably two or three large nectarines. Uh, a lot of people use peaches, which, you know, I grew up, my grandparents had a peach orchard, so I avoid peaches. Uh, <laughs> because, okay. You had yeah, enough I when you were a kid. Have you yeah, ever I picked them? You. Have you ever picked peaches? Because mm -hmm. it's, it's peach fuzz and it's mm -hmm. horrible. Yeah. And then about a pint of raspberries. Mm, my favorite. Okay. I love raspberries. That's right. And I like to get the stems in there, too. Okay. Okay? And I'm using some mandarin oranges just because I think they're kind of cute. Um, look at those. Look at that. Look at that. How look cute that. is that? How cute is that? <laughs> a little cute tease. Yeah. Um, throw those in there. And then all I'm going to do to kind of get things started is add, I'm adding a little Grand Galley. You can add Cointreau, Grand Meunier, whatever you want. What kind of orange liqueur, Yeah, right? any kind of orange, or brandy if brandy. you want. I love the smell of that So stuff. probably, yeah. yeah. Mm. I want you just to hold that and smell oh, it for okay. a minute, Yeah, okay? I'll just sniff it. All right, local, keeping it local, she guys. Off the stool, uh, just Pink from House, sniffing. that's right, from sniffing. <laughs> yeah. uh, Pink House Alchemy has this great lavender syrup. So simple just syrup. Shout out. We just gave them, pink, yeah. Yeah, because they were featured on the Today Show recently, one of the, um, the bomb. six yes. LGBTQIA plus businesses to support during And I know uh, she's been doing a lot of work at the Smithsonian mm -hmm. here recently. And yeah. then a little bit of lemonade, right? And okay. then we're going to take just a really, whatever. It doesn't have to be great, but I mean, I use like. I typically, for a sangria, will not use a bottle of wine that's over 20 bucks. That's yes. what I do. Okay. Good to know. Because we're fortifying I mean, you're adding it. so much flavor yeah. to it right, right here anyway. We don't need it. Okay, so the next thing, this is the pro tip that I'm going to kind of show you guys. Okay, so you put all the fruit in there. You got your orange liqueur, yep. a little bit of lemonade, yep. some lavender syrup. Uh, a little lavender syrup. syrup. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then gotcha. we're going to top it with just a little bit of sparkling water okay. to give a little okay. effervescence, right? Little Love, love a good little bubble. We need a little bubble just to kind of lift our spirits, uh -huh. right? Now, here's kind of the cool pro tip that I'm going to show you guys. Betsy, if you will just kind of stir that Absolutely. for me for just a moment, that would be awesome. Okay, so... Here's a here's a great cute way to just do Get keeping it cool. Um, keeping it cool with case. Yeah, yeah, is freeze yeah. some strawberries ahead of time. Uh, I was wondering why those are they okay. were yeah. so frozen. So now they're like little ice cubes. Okay, and what I like to do also, and I know that this overhead camera is not going to capture this, <laughs> but add some mint. Look at that. Um, look at to that. To your ice cubes, just to your ice cubes right there, and then add those. It goes see. right in. Goes uh -huh. yeah. right watch in the glass. Yeah. Okay, watch this. That was the angle of the camera. Watch this. Oh, there, there we go. There we go. Yeah. If you think I'm gonna fail, no. Yes. You're probably right. Okay. Yeah. Boom. There we go. There we go. Uh -huh. Now all we're gonna do, and then I like to add a little bit of mint, or you can add basil, whatever you want, just to the it. glass. Yep. Mm -hmm. Um, just like this. Just like this. And you know what else is really great in these guys is. Uh, a little bit of cucumber. Oh, yeah. Oh, of course. Yeah. Uh, if you are Very growing cucumbers nice. right now, they're really delicious. So let's get this guy right in, and you're going to get a little fruit Ooh, in there. I love that. Okay. I love Jason's nice. expectation that we all have these gardens that are I know, everybody has a garden. Right. We can yeah. just go and grab our mint and freeze do. them in our cubes. I know you do. Or I just do go to the farmer's herbs. market. You have your herbs, so yeah, you have part of this. Okay. So now keep in mind that typically this would go for a little bit longer. Did you have the strawberry? You need a strawberry in that lunch oh, that you're I'll, about I'll to put pretend it, yeah. is just You're just going to do that one, buddy? Yeah. Okay, there you go. Thank you. Ladies. Ladies. You can have one of those. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Okay. And here's the sip, right. sip sangria. Take a little sip. sip, sip tell sangria. me what you think. Yeah. Cheers. Okay. I'm ready to sip sip. Ooh. I mean, isn't oh, this a great really like a yeah. July drink? Yeah. yeah, it's a little bit sweet, but that's what that's what you want. Mm -hmm. I mean, for sure. you want on the fifth to have a real hangover. And yeah. This is, yeah, actually, 100%. this is not going to do it because if you think about it, guys, um, there's not a lot of alcohol in no. this. One. No, right, not yeah. a huge amount. There's juice. There's a little bit of the 
of the Grand Gala, and then the wine's a dry wine. So actually, you can sip and sip, and you're going to feel fine the next day. Yeah, I love that it's absolutely. light. It's going to be so hot. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And it's refreshing, too, especially yeah. if you add that cucumber. Oh, yeah. It would be very good. Well, speaking of, of 